Hello ladies and gentlemen, uh, welcome to Austin's Daily Show. Today's topic is about sex addiction. You know, it's a topic I've been sharing with my co-worker, a question they asked me the other day. You know, do people actually have what they call sex uh, issue? Like, can somebody, can, can this sex addiction be true? This is my own opinion. I don't know about you. You can only... It can only be a problem sexually. Sex can be only be, can only be a problem if when you're dealing with somebody, you know, when you two are not compatible sexually. If you have a high sex drive and your partner have low sex drive, it's only gonna be a problem, you know, because not because you cannot satisfy your your other partner. Just because when you want it, how much you want it might not be the same way the other person want it. So it's a problem then. But when you are actually with somebody that has the same high sex drive that you have, it's not called sex addiction then. It's a normal life because nobody is complaining. When there's nobody complaining, it's not a problem. When somebody is complaining, saying, oh, all he want, all what, all she want is sex all the time. It's not an addiction then. It's only an addiction when your sex partner have a low sex drive. That is what I think it is. That is what I think it should be. I'm not talking about people, you know, doing some crazy stuff. About, and I'm talking about people trying to molest little kids, trying to do some crazy shit in bed with somebody. That's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about normal people with normal relationship. I have been with uh, someone, you know, whose sex drive was just as good as mine. I never complained, she never complained. We were good, you know. Then I have been with, you know, some other people whose dr sex drive were low compared to mine. Mine is high. So, they tell me, oh, you have, uh, you know, you have a problem. You know, it's like, I'm like, what problem do you think I have? Like, you need to go to rehab for what? You know? So, in other words, when you are dealing with somebody who says driving slow, it's always going to come to that. And besides, there are some women out there, or there must be men out there, likewise, I would say, put it both ways, who think when you have sex with them, or when they have sex with you, they're doing you a favor. You know, we are we are all grown ups. There's no case here, but the thing is, if you are dealing with somebody who is selfish, who don't think they have anything to gain out of you know having sex, love making, it's gonna be a problem. There are women that think they're doing you a favor. I've, I've seen people like that, and there are some men that think they're doing some ladies' favor too when they have sex with them. So, in other words, in my dictionary, there is no such thing as sex addiction when you are sexually compatible. That's what I think. I don't know about you. If you think about something different, just let me know. So, that's just something I want to share with you guys today. You take care of yourself and God bless, okay?